Ricky Chu here, and for all you 240 owners that are looking to upgrade or replace your radiator, Mishimoto has the right one for you. It's inexpensive, durable, and easy to install. We'll show you how to do it on this 1995 Nissan 240SX. Whether you have the stock KA motor or an SR20 swap, Mishimoto makes radiators for both options. Tools needed for this install are flat and Phillips head screwdrivers, a ratchet, 10 millimeter socket, and a radiator hose pick. Make sure the engine is cooled off before starting this install to avoid serious injury. You need the car off of the ground, so use a lift if you have one, or jack and jack stands if you don't. The first step is to remove the radiator cap. Under the car, loosen the plug and let the coolant drain into a bucket. Loosen the clamps for both the top and bottom radiator hoses. Loosen the 10 millimeter nuts and remove the radiator brackets. Remove the radiator overflow hose. If your intake is in the way, remove it and set it to the side. Slowly take out your stock radiator. Side by side, you can see how much thicker the Mishimoto radiator is compared to your stock one. This leads to a cooler and more efficient motor. If you have electric fans and stock radiator hoses, transfer them to the Mishimoto unit. Otherwise, Mishimoto offers dual electric fans with a shroud and heavy duty silicone hoses. Carefully lower the new radiator into place. Secure the top and bottom radiator hoses by tightening their clamps. Replace the two radiator brackets and tighten the 10 millimeter nuts. Put back the radiator overflow hose. Use the funnel and fill up the new radiator with coolant. Start your engine and let it warm up to allow air bubbles to get out. There's a bleeder bolt on the water neck. Loosen that to get out any excess air pockets. Once there are no air bubbles left, replace the radiator cap. Make sure there are no leaks, then go for a test drive while keeping an eye on your temperature gauge. Drive safely and enjoy your new Mishimoto radiator.